4K video will be alright anyway, so. Hi Adam, how you doing? Yeah, you alright, you Joel? Not bad, not bad. Um, so, what have you been up to? Uh, just, um, I had a friend visiting from Sydney on the weekend. Oh yeah. Um, and um, went to a concert on Saturday night. Which what concert? Cool. Amanda Palmer. Um, Who's she's that? an American, uh, kind of a folky American singer. And oh, right. pi um, piano player. And she also plays the ukulele, like one of those little little guitars. It's pretty oh, yeah, cool. Yeah. How the, about the you? The one with four strings. I think so, yeah, yeah. yeah. Did you like it? Yeah, it was excellent. Yep. Excellent. Um, and um, we got to meet her after the concert, which was pretty cool. All right. Did you sign your um... uh, CD? I bought a copy CD, of yes. her latest CD. Yeah. All right. Um, so, what have you been up to? Uh, not not much. Just playing music on on the Saturday and um, and the Sunday as well, actually. Nice, nice. Broke a couple of strings on my guitar. So we're to the service today. Where are we right now? We're on the new campus, I suppose. Mm. Uh, walking by the IT building. Yeah, yeah. And there's some students. Uh, uh, not ours. Yeah, they're not our students. But... And there's a bus. No, oh, yeah, there's always a bus. Anyway, free. Yeah. Okay. Um. All right. What do you like best about ANU campus? Uh, the fact that it's the biggest campus in Australia. I did not know if that. Not, if not the. Southern Hemisphere, actually. It is a pretty huge campus. It is pretty. I mean, I mean, like one homogenous campus. Hello. Um, if you're gonna, if you're gonna go for a coffee, where would you pick at ANU? I would probably go either Gods for good coffee, although it is expensive, or I would probably go to the refectory next to the burger place. No, next to the, next to Subway. Rather, I oh, say. next to Subway. Oh yeah. Yes, yeah, good. Yeah, it's, yeah. Uh, it's not. It's not bad coffee, and it's also cheap. Yeah, yeah. All right. But I wouldn't go to coffee grounds because. Uh, the staff are nice, but the the queues are huge. Yeah, it's too busy. It's too always, busy. it's always busy. Um, so, um, what do you like best about living in Canberra? How long have you lived in Canberra, Adam? Uh, I've lived there for about seventeen years now, maybe longer. Mm. I'm not sure actually. I was actually born here, but I've only been back for about three years. So, um, is there anything about Canberra that disappoints you? Uh, yes, the lack of decent public transport. Yeah, yeah. The, Action buses aren't the best. Well, there's um, no action in them. No, that's right. Um, so, um, so what's something you like about Canberra? Uh, the fact that it's a very quiet city and it's a very safe city and it's also a very green city. Yeah, that is. So, it's um, one of those places that I actually... Now, initially, it was a bit strange because I come from... I actually come from a multi-million... Which, which city are you from? I'm from Moscow myself. Mm -hmm. It's uh, the capital of Russia, for those of you who don't know. Uh, and Russia is the biggest country on the planet. Mm -hmm. It's also bigger than Pluto. Wow. Yes. Well, not a planet anymore. Not either. Not a planet anymore anyway, so... Well, it's, it's a dwarf planet. That's right. Yes. Planet dwarf. To me, anyway. Pluto will always remain a planet. Me too. It's, yeah. Yes. One of the nine. All right. Um, so, um, when you first came to Canberra, how did you travel here? I travelled here by plane. Uh, from Russia, I went through Japan, so I went. I had to fly nine hours to Tokyo, mm -hmm. uh, and after that I stayed there. Then I stayed the night there. Then another nine hours to Sydney, and then another what half an hour to Canberra. Was Canberra what you were expecting when you got here? Uh, well, I've already, uh, I'd already seen it before that. So oh, okay. I, um, uh, first time I came here was in 1997. And then I knew it was a small city. It was very quiet then as well, so I suppose I sort of knew what I was getting into, mm -hmm. but not too much. So, um, the next time you're going to Russia, what souvenirs from Canberra will you buy to give your relatives and friends in Russia? Uh, probably... Um, what would you call one of those things? A kangaroo skin mm -hmm. with a bit of fur on it, because it's quite nice to sit on and it's very warm. Mm -hmm. Also, perhaps a kangaroo paw scratcher. For the back, oh yeah, back scratcher. Oh, the kangaroos are really going to cop it when Artem goes to buy some souvenirs. Yes. Okay, make a video like this and put, post a link on the forums. All right, have fun, mate. See ya. Enjoy Bye. your holiday. Bye.